Hey there, Ryan Lee here with Wichita Cheapskate. In this video, I'm going to talk all about your home appraisal and what to expect with that. So the home appraisal, uh, what it basically is, is it's to protect you and then also the lender who is going to be financing your purchase from uh, getting a house that uh, is not worth uh, what the, the selling price is. This is just to make sure that uh, you're not getting in over your head. You're not getting upside down in a house. And so the appraiser is going to come out and what he's going to, what he's going to do is going to, he's going to look at comparable cells in your area, uh, houses that are a lot like yours, bedrooms, bathrooms, square footage, some of the amenities, some of the features of the house. He's going to look at houses around your area that have sold similar to that. He's going to factor in any kind of renovations that have happened since the last appraisal. He, and then finally he may, uh, use a little bit of the county appraisal for your taxes, um, but not too much goes into that. So uh, he's going to take all that and then he's going to determine your home's value uh, based on uh, all of those things that he, he has looked into. It usually takes him about, you know, sometimes two hours. I think two hours is probably a good estimate of how long it takes. Two, sometimes three. And Usually, you get the results back fairly quickly. It could be three days, but I've seen it stretch out all the way to a week. So there's real, no, really no way of knowing for sure, but your first person, the first person who's going to know is going to be your lender. So just communicate to your lender that you really would like to see that appraisal report. You're actually entitled by law to see that appraisal report, but uh, it might expedite it if you just communicate with them that as soon as you get that in that you'd like to see that. So... Typically, the appraiser, the appraisal is going to cost around $500, uh, give or take $100, and that is usually paid for by the buyer uh, because this is looking out for you. Uh, this is making sure that you're not getting into a situation where you're getting into a house that's over your head. Now, one thing to be aware of is if you absolutely love this house and you this is your house, this is the one that you want, and the, say the appraisal comes in low, you can go back to the nego negotiation board with the seller and determine you know, if they can come down on the price. If they won't come down and you can't work anything out, you can actually pay the difference and just borrow the money that the house appraised for. I know that's not always an option for most people, but it is an option that's out there if you were able to borrow the money or um, you, know, you had some savings like that. But... If there's anything that I wasn't able to address in this quick video, find the contact me button and uh, you know give me a shout out and I will try to answer any question um, that you have. And if you get a chance, like and share our page uh, because we really want to help out more people in our community and the more you like and share our page, the more people will get exposure to that, okay? So uh, until next time guys, take care.